Peacock 45 here. We thought we'd creep over into the woods and do a vlog and just chat with you a little bit. You know, in person, live video with the dog and everything. My trusty 4570, in case a zombie or a grizz shows up, we're prepared for any eventuality. Anyway, uh, don't leave Ginger, my baby. Come here. <laughs> we uh, thought we'd chat with you a little bit and uh, bring you up to date on a couple of things. Whatever Ginger's up to. Okay, go away. Go away. See if we can. We uh, uh, want to thank everybody again for the, the milestone of 70,000 uh, subscribers. I guess we're close to 72 now, but anyway, things are still growing, of course. And uh, posted our 400th video, you know, you know, as you know, since the last uh, vlog. And uh, that was a compilation, of course, put together by John and uh, all kinds of wild things in there, right? You never know what he's gonna dig out of the archives when it comes up on a milestone like that. I gotta quit giving him these wonderful outtakes. I gotta watch myself. <laughs> but uh, speaking of John, uh, yeah, I get a, a comment every now and then people want to uh, see John shoot more or come and talk more. And uh, if you wanna see John, he has a the channel, you know, I have a subscription, you know, to it right there on the, the front page. And most of you, I think, are aware of that. Uh, Big John 88 TN. And uh, he does some shooting there, sometimes a follow up uh, uh, shooting event, you know, with something we've been doing in a video and then some other stuff he's done. And so uh, he's, uh, you know, posting some stuff there that's some of it's different from what we're doing on the, the Hickok 45 channel. And some of it's kind of a follow up. But, you yeah, know, John shoots a lot and loves to shoot. He's not, uh, he's a little more camera shy than I am, but you'll be seeing him. And uh, he's in the, uh, the Hickok 45 song video when Steve Lee was up, you know, he's picking a guitar and that song. And so, you know, he's around and uh, he's right there behind the camera. So uh, anyway, uh, take a look at uh, some of that. He's uh, become a very good shot too over the last year or two. Uh, he's always been pretty good. You can imagine, I started him out early with a firearm evil father that I was. I had a 22 rifle and even an Uzi in his hands when he uh, could barely stand up. So, you know, just some people are crazy, I guess. Like me, sitting over here in the woods with the mosquitoes trying to eat us up. That's probably why Ginger left. Maybe she took a few mosquitoes along with her. Or maybe she remembered that I have this big four gun on my lap and she knows what will happen if I have a gun it's likely to see some action at least a couple of shots but anyway uh, let's see we haven't had a vlog since I guess we've been in our convention I've talked about that in the radio show and uh, we you know posted video on that and everything so I won't rehash all that but it was a lot of fun and I hope uh, many of you can make it next year at uh, St. Louis because that's fairly centrally located as well I guess not if you live in Maine, you know, we're Oregon, but, but anyway, uh, for us, that will be even closer than, than Pittsburgh. So barring something unforeseen, we will uh, plan to be up there and look forward to that. The ultimate gun show. You know, when I was up there, I was reminded of, uh, of a song that Hank Williams Jr. has. Uh, I don't know the name of it, but I know the, what the line is, if, if heaven ain't a lot like Dixie, I don't want to go, you know? And you're walking around the NRA convention and it's like the mecca for every firearm you could imagine. You know, you just think of that song and that line, you know, if heaven ain't a lot like this, I don't want to go, <laughs> you know. I mean, every pistol, revolver, rifle, shotgun you can imagine is right there and you can pick it up and fondle it. You can't shoot it, that's the only thing. That'd be the only next step, wouldn't it? Uh, is to be able to pick up some ammo and go out and back and shoot at some targets. But. It's a, it's a lot of fun, and again, we saw a lot of interesting folks, you know, Tom Gresham on the radio show, and Ted Nugent, and various individuals, uh, as I mentioned uh, in the, the other video and in the, uh, the radio show. So, that was a lot of fun, we enjoyed it. We met with the, uh, the ammo for sale people that, you know, have uh, donated some ammo too while we were up there, the owners of, of that company. Don't forget the, uh, uh, the promo code there, Hickok45, if you uh, have some ammo to order. We're still working on that big pile of 45 ACP, so you'll see us eat into that some more here, probably over the next week or so, and uh, get it down to the bottom of the tray. Uh, it's a worthy endeavor. It's a lot of fun too. Having a lot of fun with that. What else is going on? Let's see. As we sit out here in the woods, 
we'll be doing a lot of different sorts of videos this summer. We've got some plans to do uh, some different kinds of things. Uh, maybe some things you've been asking for. Maybe some things you have not been asking for. Because you never know what we'll be up to. But we will be uh, uh, have a little more free time. That doesn't mean we're going to do a video every day, but we'll have a little more time to, uh, to, to put towards some projects this summer. And uh, we'll be doing that. Uh, one thing I'll alert you to, we have, uh, I have agreed to allow uh, True TV to uh, use three or four different videos and they're going to chop them up. Who knows what they'll do with them, but they're, they're going to uh, do something with the uh, world's dumbest uh, theme that they do. I was not really even aware of it, you know, typical me, old guy, old school or something. I mean, I guess I'd seen pieces of that, that show or that station, but I wasn't as aware of it as, uh, as most other people seem to be. But anyway, they contacted us and wanted, to, uh, wanted some of the videos and permission to use four or five of them. And uh, so who knows what I will end up being, the world's dumbest, but I'll, I'm sure I'll be the world's dumbest something. That's supposed to air sometime in August. We'll keep you abreast of that and you'll recognize uh, clips from some of the videos that, that they're going to be using. So we'll let you know about that if that you know comes to fruition, which apparently it is. Um, so what else is going on before I take a shot or two with this beautiful gun? Uh, I can't really think of many other lies other than we're enjoying what we're doing and uh, I'm still trying to keep up with communications as best I can. But again, please read the profile. If you're a new person watching this, and I always think in terms of uh, either the longtime viewers or more loyal viewers watching the, the vlogs or listening to the radio thing, but, but it could be anybody, of course. So if you are fairly new to the channel, please read the entire profile, and it kind of gives you a rundown of uh, how I try to prioritize uh, my uh, replies or my communications with folks. Do not be offended, please. If you put your heart into a question and you've, you've written a long question and, uh, and you just don't get an answer, Try me again in a week or a month or something. You know, it also depends on when I'm at the computer too and how many questions I have or how many uh, messages I have. If I have 100 messages and I have to get through them because I, I don't let them pile up. I mean, I, I go through them every day at some point, uh, late at night, early morning, sometime, I get through them and I have to deal with them. I will not uh, have like three, 400 pile up. I, I will delete them first. So, so it kind of depends on when I'm uh, answering the messages and how many I have. It could be you get a long answer or you get a, an answer to something you didn't expect to. Then again, you may not get an answer just because uh, there are so many. So anyway, don't give up on me and uh, understand uh, the, the volume, please. Uh, what else? We just appreciate you guys you know, keeping up with us and uh, watching the stuff we're doing because you never know what we'll be doing. Main thing is we just love to shoot. And to prove that, let me put the safety on, which it is on. So make sure I get some ears. I'm gonna shoot the ground. <laughs> That's known, ladies and gentlemen, as a lever action assault rifle. Okay? Don't you remember that now? That's a lever action assault rifle. It will get the job done. Throws out a very large slug, as many of you know, because you have been educated. If you've been around the channel very long, you're well aware that I'm a fan of the 4570 in that big old case, that big old bullet. It's a lot of fun to throw, isn't it? So anyway, you can tell I don't have a lot of topics today. I just wanted to chat with you a little bit. We haven't done a vlog for a few uh, weeks or month or more. And uh, it's uh, it's going well, and we just really do appreciate y'all watching. So. Hopefully you'll, uh, you'll stay tuned and help me manage the channel, help us as much as you can by uh, maybe answering people, maybe you send them a private message, they have a question. You know, I don't really answer uh, questions on the profile. Uh, I try to make that really clear. It's got to be a private message so I can just quickly reply. You know, if you see someone ask a question you think I probably haven't gotten to it, or it looks like I haven't, or it's on the profile, and you've got something to add, uh, please do. There's a lot of experience out there. Some of you are new shooters but quite a few of you have quite a bit of uh, experience. So uh, help me any way you can, and uh, that helps everybody. So it's like one big happy shooting family, you know, so we can all help educate each other. Because I don't know everything, 
I just been messing with this stuff long enough to where I know I know a little bit about a lot of stuff and a lot about a little of it, you know. But uh, being a jack of all trades, there's uh, there's specifics that I just don't know, guns I don't keep up with, that kind of thing. So anyway, we really appreciate your support and your watching, and uh, y'all take care because you know life is definitely good.